Today we're going to make everyone's favorite Girl Scout. Hello, welcome back to Cooking Kason. This is the first episode of Gluten Free in 5 Minutes where I show you how to make a gluten free treat in 5 minutes or less. My dog just came in to help us. Like, yeah, yeah. Today we're going to make everyone's favorite Girl Scout cookie, Thin Mints. For our gluten free Thin Mints, you will need Enjoy Life double chocolate cookies, extra crunchy, one cup of Enjoy Life chocolate chips, about a tablespoon's worth of vegetable oil of your choosing, I have chosen grapeseed, and some mint extract. You will also need a pan with some wax paper on it. Yes, I know it doesn't fit exactly. Carl. Step one, pour yourself a glass of white wine because you are stressed about moving. Or whatever you're stressed about. Done. Step two, take your vegetable oil. Pour out about, nope, that's not right. You're gonna start with a teaspoon of oil over your cup of chocolate chips. You don't want to over oil your chocolate or it will not set on your cookie. So start with about a teaspoon. If you need more oil later because your chocolate isn't smooth enough, you can add it later, but start small. It's like salt in a way. Step three, step three. Take your chocolate and stick it in the microwave. You're gonna melt it using 15 second intervals. You don't want to burn your chocolate, so make sure you check it every 15 seconds. We just wanna get it nice and smooth. No! Oh. Stir in between 15 second intervals. It's a little too thick, so I'm gonna add another teaspoon of oil. Half teaspoon. Step four, add a half teaspoon of mint extract to your chocolate, or more if you're super minty. While the chocolate is still hot, take a fork, take one of your extra crunch cookies, dump it in the chocolate very lightly, turn it over inside of there, just ever so gently. Place it on your wax paper. If your chocolate starts getting too thick again, stick it back in the microwave for 10 seconds until it gets nice and smooth. Forget which step you are on because you are drinking. Do not concern yourself with how much chocolate is on each cookie. It's just more chocolate. If you want to be cool, you can make some that are just like half dipped. Those look fancier. Artisan cookie? Step 12, wait impatiently for your cookies to set. And by set, I mean the chocolate gets hard again. You got it. Step nine, put your cookies in the freezer because life is too short to wait for anything. Step 12, while you're waiting, put on your overpriced anthropology apron that you just bought. And God, I didn't get any chocolate on it. You're so beautiful. Step 12, take your cookies out of the freezer. Step 13, put them on a pretty plate. Step most important, enjoy yourself a gluten-free Thin Mint. Yup. Hello and welcome to the, uh, today we're gluten free thin mints. They're not gluten free. This is five minutes to gluten free. No, that, no, that's not what it is. Amazing, amazing. Well, about a tablespoon's worth of vegetable, bleh, bleh. about a tablespoon's worth of, bleh. 
about a tablespoon's worth of a vegetable. What step are we on? 